today we are going to show you something crazy. We're gonna show you something pretty nuts. We've got a 90s bedroom, okay, preserved. All right, preserved 90s bedroom. It's Amanda's bedroom. It's my freaking bedroom, people. It's her freaking bedroom, dude. So anyway, we're gonna go check out this bedroom that is literally preserved from the 90s, okay? This is gonna be nuts, dude. This is gonna be super nostalgic. All right, people, this is probably an extremely weird angle because I'm driving, but I just wanted to let you know, I haven't lived in this room since I was about seven years old. Yes, I came back to visit here and there. So most of the items are from around that time, late 90s, early 2000s. You're gonna get, you know, first-hand look at it. First-hand, not the second one. There's no second-hand looks around here, none. Comment down below if you've ever commented down below. You're a rev reading. We appreciate you. Hey guys, so we're here. I'm going to show you my childhood bedroom now. Um, before we get in, I actually made this as a child and it hangs here on the door. Are you excited? Oh yeah. Let's go in. Damn. All right. This is so crazy. <laughs> So as you can see here, I still have this flower wallpaper, okay? I loved the Brat dolls back in the day. Have to show you that real quick. <laughs> that was something that was huge for me. You can tell I loved pink. I have pink trim on the walls. Oh yes, I see that right there. I loved stuffed animals, dolls, all the above. Check out all the old toys in here. When I was younger, I actually used to have a Barbie computer here. It's no longer. Those old computers are obsolete. So my dad got rid of it. But this is actually my PS2 from way back when I was a little gal. Sick. Dude. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2. This is crazy. There's even a random Wii game in here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I loved Crash Bandicoot. That was my favorite PlayStation 2 game. My favorite one. Naughty. That's nostalgic. I wanted to start off over here. This is me just when I was a little tyke. <laughs> Don't I look cute? It's kind of dark in here, hold on. Yeah, let's bring it out in the light. <laughs> that was little, me, guys. Little baby Amanda. Adorable. I had this award I got in 2002. It's an accelerated reader award. As you can see right there, it is actually from 2002. <laughs> Pretty nutty. Quick out of Amanda and SpongeBob here. <laughs> <laughs> I was a huge fan of Spongebob. <laughs> this is from one of our trips to Disney World. We have some receipts. We even have like a Mickey dollar right here. Some really old advertisement for the park. This right here is actually a little voucher for a stroller and wheelchair. I had a stroller because I was only four years old at the time. I know it's kind of hard to read, but right here, this is from 2-27-1998. Just to give you guys a little glimpse of that. Anyways, let's move on. So, a couple of things that I wanted to point out that I were also in my childhood, or for one, is check out this dog down here. I don't know if anybody else had one of these, but I actually had a robo dog and a real dog. I'm gonna pull this out real quick. But it even had like a little robo treat and stuff and it would bark and my real dog was not having it. <laughs> my real dog was like, no way, that terrifies me. And this is like one of those classic little posters from uh, from like the fair or something. Yeah, I think I got this at one of the fairs, like, you know, when you play the balloon game? You yeah. Cards, I'm pretty sure I got it from that. That itself is pretty nostalgic, but... Um, I was just going to say, I also noticed there was a Woody over here. 
And that's pretty sick. I had that same Woody that looks like one of the original ones. That's pretty crazy. All right, so this looks a little dirty. It might be from sweat, who knows. But this is my visor from Disney World. Literally. <laughs> How's it look? I probably look like Amazing. Weirdo. Does it look good? Amazing. Yeah, incredible. We can go out right now. We probably should. Is that Little Bear? It's Little Bear. I love Little Bear. Little Bear. That was one of my favorite cartoons. That's awesome. There's so many little, like, uh, nostalgic gems hidden in here that I'm sure people will recognize if they uh, grew up in the 90s, early 2000s. So crazy. I think this one I, right here is from a claw machine. I used to love claw machines. <laughs> like, when we were younger, anytime I seen one, I was like, hey, yo, dad, yo, mom, can I get 75 cents? That way, you know, I'd be playing, playing. Playing and playing. Ah. Here's another good one. Oh, A Bug's Life. A Bug's Life. Wow. Another good movie. You got a Care Bear hiding back there? <sighs> Nuts. Can we talk about how many Angelicas this girl's got? <laughs> these are like classic too. I mean, the uh, odds are these are probably worth money even. Probably. This is like a little Princess Angelica here. Yeah, you can fix the TR some other time, but I've never seen anything like that. And then I seen another one right there, a big one, with another little one beside it. Wait, is that another one? Yeah, look at all these. Oh, this I one didn't is wrapped I had in a three whole. Of them. This one's wrapped in a <laughs> diaper. Why is it? That... Are you nuts, dude? <laughs> well, I Why remember. Is there a diaper on that I remember one? <laughs> playing as a little kid. I always like trying to um, practice being a mom and like putting diapers on things. <laughs> so this one still has the diaper. That's crazy. That's pretty cool. Wow. Oh, I this one does too. Still got an old diaper on it. Wow. That's pretty nuts. And I remember these from uh, toy machines all the time, dude. Yeah, that these one was These would be in like bowling alleys machines. and stuff. Mm hmm Look at that. Rock Around the Mouse. That's a classic poster for sure, too. I even remember these little s scooter people. Scooter dolls. Like... <laughs> Oh, yes. That's this crazy. was cool. It actually moved around like it had batteries and... Oh, hey! Another another hidden gem. <laughs> there she is. Do you think I look the same, guys? Do I, do I still look like this? Comment down below. Comment down below. Real classic. Look at that Barbie. That's a My Scene doll. Oh, is it? That's why I always sing... You know where to hide me? It's My Scene. <laughs> That's what it's from. We'll have to put a clip of that. You know I mean, Look how 90s that My Scene doll looks, though. That's so 90s right there. This is so 90s. That's so 90s. Um, I wanted to point this out. My dad, I believe, actually carved this. And I think he colored it as well. But this is, like, really old. So I wanted to show you guys that. That was pretty cool. You got the SpongeBob poster. Krabby Patties. The hot, steamy goodness. Hot, steamy. Oh, yeah. We got this thing. It looks like it's from the 90s. What even is this? Is this soap? Glitter gel. People glitter look, gel? You just put it in your hair. Like, nowadays, people think it's cool to do glitter roots. It was cool just to glitter your whole head. What? Basically. That's pretty crazy, guys. You got the tie beanies. Definitely a classic 90s staple. Dude, you got Jeffrey the Giraffe? Happy birthday to you! Thanks, everyone. Oh, this is great. So, where are my presents? Well, Jeffrey, we thought this year instead of giving you presents, we'd give our guests a free present whenever they bought two select items. Whose idea was that? It was Brandt. Don't miss Jeffrey's amazing birthday sale. Buy two items and get a third one free on thousands of select toys like All Bay Blades, Leapfrog Products, Swan Lake Barbie, Movies, and more. Jeffrey! That is so, so nostalgic. cool. Dude, that's so cool. I can't believe you have that. Remember, animals are people too. <laughs> well, well, not really. <laughs> Let's play. I have to say that. I'm a toy. <laughs> Come on, squeeze me. Oh, all right. Not that hard. Have you hugged your giraffe today? I'll always stick my neck out for you. <laughs> I love toys 
so much, I became one. <laughs> What's the matter? You never seen a talking giraffe before? I can't believe this still works. I'm I'm mind blown by that. That would probably be worth money since there's like no Toys R Uses anymore. Yeah, yeah. You I know, miss that store. I also have a Jeffrey the Giraffe in the package, but it's like the rubber bendable one, collectible series. Had to get it, seen it at Ollie's. It was a must. Neither of us seem to know what these are called, but dang it, it looks familiar. They used to come, like, this is a baby. There was a whole mom, and they'd be in the stomach or whatever, and... Oh, it, is it this? Is it this oh, blue thing? Yes, I didn't know if I still have it or not, actually. Yeah, grab that. I'm gonna try to grab it without causing an avalanche over here. Okay, hold on a minute, guys. Trying not to cause a mess here. Nostalgia is pouring out. I'm an M guy right there. If anyone knows what these are called, please comment down below. But anyways, now I can actually show you. So all I know is the stomach opens up somehow and there's these little babies that come out. I don't really want to break it. I can't get it open. It just opened right there. No, but right here is where they would they would come in and out of. Oh. Mm-hmm. Let's do a little investigating real quick, guys. Oh, pouch release. Looks like maybe you broke it off as a child. Rebirth. I don't know what this thing does. It's weird. We need to put some batteries in this thing. I just remember it made like really weird noises and these little babies would come out. If you look, there's another little baby or something in there. There's like an egg in there. There's something in there, dude. We're going to have to put batteries in this, guys. And we're going to have to see. It kind of looks like a Furby, dude. I it know. It says 1999 Trend Masters Inc. Made in China. Well, look at that, uh, 1999 there. That's pretty wild. Love Love is here with a wonderful surprise. Wow. Special delivery. Love Love Baby. Okay, so while I was over here, I stumbled upon some more stuff here. We got some animals from the Jungle Book here. And look at this. We got more McDonald's toys. We got Sebastian here. From Little Mermaid. We got a dinosaur and we got Buzz back there. Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear still kicking it. Looks like his helmet needs repaired. He sustained some damage in a galactic battle. He's going to be all right, folks. He's going to be all right. This dinosaur is protecting him. His little friends are here to heal him up. There's one of those weird looking Beetleborg type things in the back. What is that, guys? What is that red and white checkered thing? What is it? Oh, that? grab that. That thing was so cool. Grab it. Let me get, try to get little Mickey out the way here. Oh, that was Minnie. Then we got a swimming bear thing for a dog. This is gonna be a tough one, guys. Wow, that's old. Give me a hand, Buzz. Give me a hand. What even is this? I remember, um, okay, so it looks like it, it might be a little bit broken, but when it worked back in the day, you like put it on the floor and it makes all kinds of crazy noises. Also, what? if you guys know what this is, definitely comment down below. I don't remember the name of it. I just remember it was like crazy, it, like dances and... I have never seen anything like this thing. It's, it's wild. I've never seen anything like this. It looks like a jester clown I'm gonna thing. I'm going to see if it turns on, but it, it probably doesn't. Dude... Let's see. Oops, sorry. I think. Nah, I don't think it's going to turn on. Wow. But anyway, that's crazy. This stuff is wild. She's got so much cool things in it. Look at this inflatable SpongeBob. I've always been a big fan of Bob, you know? Sponge Robert. He's a cool dude. Wow tiny purses this was actually one of my purses back in the day when you were like five <laughs> i don't know but um i got a little care bear look i got a little arby's mitt isn't that cool Dude, that is so cool that is so cool what i love this arby's mitt that is amazing i love i love random little things like that guys i will collect anything like that should we see what's inside my purse let's see what's let's dig through your purse Let's see. Well, looks like we got a pair of earrings. We got an empty little thing that obviously came out of a machine. 
Okay. You got any V-Bucks in there? Can I don't I think V-Bucks were around back then. Got any Monopoly money in there? I still have an old chapstick. <laughs> so that's cool. most ridiculous things ever dude remember these they used to have these at like chuck e cheese or quarter machines or something i think i got this from midway park not gonna lie wow midway playing more at nostalgia. the arcade more nostalgia oh do you remember these these little sizzlers. magnet things sizzlers all right people i don't know if you ever seen these when you were a kid but i did there you go you had to, you had to throw them up in the air and they would come together because they're magnets. It's pretty cool. That's crazy. Wow, all kinds of just luxurious <laughs> items coming out of here. Just random stuff. Oh, an old gift card. Oh, wow. I bet there's like three, four hundred thousand dollars on there, probably. <laughs> Maybe. After the party, go shopping at Walmart. Wow. And last but not least, <laughs> I carried this around in my purse, always Dude, ready to have that, that hair tie. <laughs> is that a little hair tie person? Yeah, look it's at that. little arms. Isn't that cool? Oh, that's like a little flat Stanley. Mm -hmm. Hey, comment down below if you remember flat Stanley. If you know the reference, let me know. So Amanda just found some receipts in here. Let's take a look at one of these receipts and let's see what little Amanda was buying. Okay, we'll pull one. Oh, of course it was a Walmart receipt. Okay, Walmart, let's see what little Amanda bought. Wow, I spent a whopping 92 cents on lip gloss. Wow, lip gloss, her lip gloss was popping. My lip gloss be popping. It was popping and still is. These posters. These posters are so 90s. The Happy Bunny. I used to have a Happy Bunny hoodie. I wish I still had it to show you guys. Yeah. Wow, man. I just want to say, too, I don't know what this alligator thing is, but it looks familiar. It looks familiar. Also, I found a notebook from back in the day, so I'm going to open it up and see if I have any cool notes to share with you guys. What did she say? What did I say to my future self? Let's see. Well, so far it looks like some scribbles. A little scribble scrabble. This must be from way back because wow, it looks like nice. I clearly didn't know how to do much. It's beautiful. What's that? That's a school bus. I think this is a bus. That's a school bus, guys. Oh my gosh, it's just like little little Butterfly. drawings. This might be before I Butterfly. even knew how to write. Butterfly and an apple tree. Let's go. Let's keep going. I'm I'm so good at this game. Oh no, is that it? <laughs> is that really it? Oh wait, wait, I see something here. Let's go. Wow, this I must be that before was. I knew how to write. I don't know what that is, guys. Guys, we had a hardcore game of Pictionary going on here. I wish we could have continued, but there's not. Hold on. Is there one more? There's more. Let's take a look. Oh, dude, I know this one. This is, uh, that, uh, I, I don't know. I, have, I don't, I don't know. Okay, that might be it. I think that's it, folks. That's it, folks. That was incredible. Even as a little young being, she was just an artist. Look at that creepy baby. This is kind of weird, that honestly. Oh, that definitely freaks me out. I don't like that thing. I don't know how I feel about her. You know what I do like, though? Animals are people, too. <laughs> I tell you what, I love my pooch and my cat. Like they're my own little people. Like I made them. <laughs> Do you guys remember <laughs> doing this back in the day? Woo! She was a pro! Remember when you'd be in a claw machine and there'd be a random flower in there? This is that flower that you never got. That flower that you never caught for your significant other or maybe yourself. It's right here. And look at this cabbage patch, kid. 
This little Cabbage Patch doll was trying to hide out in here. Didn't want to be seen. We see you with that Cabbage Patch mouth. Dude, it's got soft cheeks. It's got skin. That's an old one. It has skin. Why does it have skin? And as usual, if you dug this video, make sure you like, make sure you comment, and make sure you subscribe. Because Amanda's riding on a little pony. Literally. And I've got my robo dogs here. We're ready to just hit the town. We're ready to live in the 90s again. Woo! 90s! If you dug this, let us know. We're going to put this on TikTok. Like, comment, and subscribe. Do it for the robo pooch. Bark. Do it for the 90s. Oh, yeah.